Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Wengil Zalala. Today I just wanted to talk about Ahmoud Arbery. I hope I'm pronouncing his name right. He was murdered, um, he was gunned down and murdered in the US. He was a black man um, jogging. I will show you the video, but I don't want it to be graphic. It's graphic. After I saw it, I couldn't even sleep well. So I will cut down where he dies. But like, let me show you a video, short clip, and I'll come back. Yeah, so these two men um, gunned him down. He was jogging and um, they killed him. From the reporting, um, it is said that they thought he was stealing and they said that he was on a construction site. So construction site means it was an empty place. There's nothing to steal, even if he was trying to, there's nothing. So, but it appears from the video, what it appears is he's just jogging. He doesn't have anything on him from what I can see. You'll tell me if you see anything else. And he's just running and um, they attack him. He fights back, he tries to fight back, but there are guns involved and um, they gun him down and he just dies. And the unfortunate thing about this story is this happened two months ago. They were not in jail. Nothing was happening to them until this video surfaced. Two months, they were free men. Like, if this is how our brothers and sisters in the US are living and this is their reality, it's really sad. It's really sad. And um, even if he was stealing, let's just, let's just talk about it. Even if he was stealing, what's with the killing? I know there's something called citizen's arrest or something like that, that a civilian can, uh, um, can take you in um, if, he, if, if, if you're caught doing something. But they didn't take him in. They killed that young man right there. They fought him. They chased him. It felt like it was modern time lynching. It's just, it was so horrible to watch. This is really unfortunate. Like there are people like this who give no regard to a human life. That's a human being. That's a, a somebody's son. That's somebody's brother. That's somebody's friend. You know, um, like I even saw this guy made a video in support of Amud and running with a TV. He's a white guy with a TV and he's jogging and he's like, um, look, I'm jogging and nothing is happening to me in the same suburban white uh, community area and nobody's shooting at me i wonder why hey guys going on a nice leisurely jog here in the south in a suburb carrying a tv and perfectly safe wonder why that is i run with a mod he's insinuating that it's because he's white and amud was murdered in cold blood for doing that Probably he was not even carrying anything just because he's running. Maybe they suspected that he's up to no good. And if it's just about this, the color of his skin, this is heartbreaking. Nobody, nobody deserves to be killed like this in the middle of a street for doing nothing but running, for doing nothing but jogging. I hope this criminals gets what they deserve and this young man gets his justice. Let's all have his family in our prayers and hope that this kind of discrimination, injustice, racism and murder stops by standing with Ahmoud and making sure that these people pay for what they have done. They understand the cruelty of what they've done. They understand that they have taken a life for no good reason. I really want to hear the whole story. Hopefully when they go to court, it's going to be an open case and all of us will get to hear uh, the backstory of it. But the video already tells the story. An armed man jogging, two armed men with another person filming, chasing him and gunning him down and he died. So that's the story the video tells. We'll see what the justice system will do and hopefully they do right by this young man. 
Thank you guys for watching. I will see you on the next one. Stay blessed. Bye.